Hello and you're very welcome to watching this replay and tonight we've talked about failure is success turned inside out. I'm a Queen fan, I love Queen's music Freddie Mercury and I only really got into Queen when Freddie died in 1991 and when I heard they were making a movie of his life I was so excited. And finally, and it seemed like years, and finally, it was there and Rami made the video, made, played Freddie Mercury, and I went to see the film twice. And it was amazing. And there was times that Rami became Freddie. And the video, the film was amazing. But what I loved, 1985, I was 13, and I was, loved music. And I didn't have a television at the time. At home, we didn't have a television. So I was listening to it on the radio and recording it. So I didn't see the performance. I don't really remember Queen being on. But I thought, what would be amazing to go to that concert? And last year, when I went to see Bohemian Rhapsody, that's what happened. And what I seen was a man who was lonely, who was searching for identity. And on Monday night when I watched the Oscars, Rami talked about that and how he didn't know why he was picked for the film. And sometimes life works that way that we don't know what's happening with us. We don't know what's happening, you know, why is this happening to me? We can get very down about it. But I don't know if you've ever noticed that in the bleakest of places, sometimes when you notice things, you notice the friends around you, you know, notice the people that love you. And that's, I suppose, where counselling does come in because counselling allows you to look at your situation. Because sometimes it's like a jigsaw puzzle that's all been mixed up and you don't know how to separate it out. It doesn't make sense. Why does that happen? Why am I feeling this way, that way, and the other? And so sometimes you come to therapy and you think, feeling really low. My goodness, I'm coming to therapy. I think that takes, I know it takes such strength to look at ourselves, to look at that particular piece of our, ju our jigsaw, our lives that we're not comfortable with, and look at it and kind of figure it out and place it back together. And that's really what counseling does. And it's hard work, really hard work. But I'm noticing at the moment, maybe it's just me, but um, Andrean Huffington, who wrote the book Flurry, she talks about how it's so important that mistakes, mistakes happen, but we always learn from them. And Oprah talks about it as well. So what, I just wanted to say was, if you're having a hard time and it can seem like like another bad thing happens and another bad thing happens and another bad thing happens and it can get a bit overwhelming, but you're never totally on your own. And that's what Freddie showed. And it's so interesting that Rami has now a girlfriend too. So there was Freddie and Mary and Mary was absolutely very awesome. There was the love of his life. And, uh, and Rami and Lucy um, have got together in a relationship and it's so lovely. And it's so great to see Queen still going strong, looking older, but still going strong. And I'm just really thankful that I got into Queen because music is so, so powerful. Freddie once said, don't try so, a song that they wrote, Queen wrote on the new end of call, don't try so hard. So don't try so hard because you're perfect the way you are. Be yourself because everyone else is taken. So that's all I wanted to say. Mind yourself, please share my video on how are you, healthcare professionals. Let's get talking. Let's see if we can find a way of providing that 15 minutes for staff to sit down and talk with someone about how they are. Mind yourself. Bye.